Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I have a rant to talk about today and I hope you enjoy. It's by the title, Apple is literally taking over the world. So, ready. Tonight I had a good night with my mom. We were just chilling. We had plans to do stuff today. My mom was in need of an upgrade on the iPhone. So I was like, okay, I'll come with you, no big deal. Um, so we went out and we were like, okay, like, let's go to a few things and, you know, and then along the way we will change her phone. My mom has the iPhone 7. So I was like, oh, like, you know, we can go get an upgrade and we're due for an upgrade. So I was like, perfect. Like my mom's due for an upgrade. Let's go do it. So we had went to Target and Target, which is interesting so we went to target and we're like roaming around but we're also like getting other things and in target which is new because before they weren't like this um they now don't switch out phones when you have verizon as your carrier they do at&t and the other one but they don't do verizon so i was like that's strange because when i got my iphone 11 i was able to go into um, target and immediately get it but I think it was because when I had gotten my iPhone 11 um, it was brand new they had it in stock and like they were doing like everybody literally was coming to them because I remember like standing on a line and like waiting to get it get it and all that stuff so that's probably their reasoning I'm not sure but so we found out today that Target does not do that so if you have Verizon you can no longer go to Target and like swap out your phone if you need an upgrade yada 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 so that was interesting but um so we couldn't do it at target but they like were really informative and like the tech guys shout out to the tech guys because they were like really informative about all of it and they were just like oh well you have to go to verizon and they were like basically telling us like why and so i was like oh perfect like thanks and so i was with my mom and i'm like okay perfect like so they're telling us we have to go to Verizon. Verizon was like in our area. So we're like, okay, cool. Let's go to Verizon. Cause I mean, we're out. And that was the main plan of the day to basically get a new phone for my mom. So we go to Verizon and we went on a good timing because like there was literally like one lady, the sales lady, and she was sitting there and we're just like, okay. Like it was just us. So it was nice. And we get, went in at good timing. So we, it was beautiful because we ended up um, just like getting like really quick customer service. Um, and obviously like with the upgrade, it takes a few minutes, like it takes some time, so understandable. Um, but the Verizon, the Verizon um, salespeople, they were amazing. The representatives, they were really nice. The one that we worked with and also like there was another guy in the background who like helped us out with some things. So it was nice that like they were there and just like they were really pleasant to be around. So. Like I said, my mom has the seven. And so she was like, okay, like what? She's basically like learning about like the newer iPhones and et cetera, et cetera. So we're talking to the lady and she's like, oh, well like you can get a 12. So we're like, oh, perfect. That's the newest one. Just like go for it. It's not a lot of money. Like with our plan, like it's, it's a good amount of money. Perfect. And she like mapped it out. Again, when I tell you like the sales representative that was with us, she was amazing with us because like she really like informed my mom about just like iphones like along the years and then also like obviously like our plan and like she like budgeted out everything and the amount of money that we're spending and stuff like that i love 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 when um especially like verizon and like apple or like you know phone techie people i love when they like literally have all the information i absolutely love that because there's some like there's been moments where like i've went to go um trade out my phone or something like that and they're like um eh, and they're kind of like he i don't know if they're hesitating or like they just don't know the answer which is totally fine because like i don't expect everybody in the world to know the answer but um our representative tonight she was absolutely amazing and like she was just like mapping it out for us and she was like well this is what your plan's gonna look like oh well this is like and then some people i like for um representatives in general um they give you like the actual like I don't, I don't know if other people have had this, but like they give you like all the options. Cause there's some people who are just like, oh, well this is your best option. And then you're like, oh, well 
if that's my only option then sure but like there's obviously other options with other plans and like different things and like so tonight she really helped us out and I really like analyzed it tonight I don't know why don't ask me but like this tonight for some reason I was like analyzing it and I'm like oh my god she was like she was a one with her customer service and she like really helped us out like I said so we're going through the whole process and she's like oh like you know you can do this you can do that for all the options and um, as she's telling my mom things and we're like okay the 12 sounds great perfect um we then found out that like i could get an upgrade so she was like you can get an upgrade too you know this is what happens with your plan and da, da, da. so we're like working together trying to figure out stuff for our plan and like what works best and like what we actually wanted so we were both able to get the iphone 12 which is beautiful so i have gotten the iphone 12 this is like the mint color they call it green like on the back it's the green but it's literally it's so nice um it is nice personally like i'm upgrading from the 11 to the 12. i do uh, personally i think it's lighter than the 11. it's obviously thicker like if you've had the 11 it's much thicker um so i like the thickness of it i don't really like the lightness of it like how it's so light because like you literally i know i have to be careful because i just got it and i don't have a case right now which i'm working on that so anybody knows any good cases for the 12 hit me up let me know but anyways yeah so i have the teal color my mother has the red so we were like perfect this is nice like you know we both got new phones so we're chilling we're like in the mood you know and like we're like in the store we're walking around and you know how like when literally a kid in a candy store when you get something new and you're like yeah you know it's like, in such a good mood i'm like yeah with my mom you know hanging out and getting good stuff like you're just getting good deals and like we got good deals with the lady so we're like bet let's go like this works this is beautiful so um as we're like waiting for our phone to like upgrade and stuff like that and even my mom me and my mom were talking about like um again back to like the customer service i think with sometimes i, I think this is i've been heavy on the apple products in my house so um we go to, obviously like we go to upgrade our apple stuff and like ipads or whatever so um today in the verizon it was like they literally were just like oh like they literally showed you she showed us step by step like i don't know if they did that for everybody but it was again like i said it was just like really good customer service and something to shout out because um you don't get that a lot like nowadays you really just don't like you don't get good customer service and because you don't for some reason like it like ruins your experience but like the fact that like our customer service like she was super nice she was super cool like she was just like chill and like she gave us so much information whenever i get a new phone um amazon is literally my best friend um i don't know if that's for anybody else but amazon is my best friend after i get a new phone because i'm literally on it like that night and i'm like mm, i need to get a case this is my case and i get my case that weekend so it works out beautifully and it's just a good experience for me when i get my phone but anyways so I got a brand new phone, guys. Still in the store, though. Back to the story. Still in the store, and, like, so we're waiting for, like, things to transfer over. We're talking to the representatives. We had stepped out to, like, go to another store, whatever, because we were, like, in a plaza. Whatever, not the point. Um, and so we come back, and, like, our phones are ready. She's teaching, like, the representative, she's, like, teaching my mom, like, how to go um, with the like, different features and, like, from... Because again, like I said, she had the 7 and now she's at the 12. So like different features have changed, like not obvious features. So um, she's just like telling my mom and I'm just sitting there just listening like, okay, like this is good details to know. Like it's just good to know, etc. So as we're going about it and she's like, da -da -da, your eyes in bed and you have your boxes in it and you're so excited, paying out, everything's good. So as she gives us our boxes, um, you know, for me, okay, so this is how I am. When I get like my Apple products, I'm literally just like, oh my God, the beautiful white box. And like, it's just, I'm just, so, personally, I don't know why, but I'm like so fascinated. I'm like, yeah, beautiful white box. Like, it's just so pretty. It's just so cute, brand new, like fresh. You know, when you see something white, you're like purity, beautiful. That's how I am. I'm so exaggerating on everything, but that's literally how I feel in my brain. So 
and I like open it and I'm like, ooh, yeah. So I'm still in the store and I open it and I go, oh, well, what's this? So the disappointment of the night, guys, is literally for the iPhone 12, they have a different port. Totally, you know, so this part obviously like goes to your phone and it's still the same as the 11. If you have the 11, it's still the same. This, on the other hand, is different. It is not like the other ones, which is, um, which it goes to standard, the, you know, just the standard iPhone box. So I'm like, oh, okay. And I just see this in my box. So I'm already like, hmm, hey, talking to her. Try not to be like a, too annoyed, although you can already tell it in my voice, but I see this, just this in this box. And then of course, like, you know, you get the Apple, you know, Apple tag, made in California, all that extra crap, right? And that's all they have. So I'm like looking and you know, sometimes they have, well, in the earlier versions of the Apple products, they have like the second layer. So you go to see like where your cord is, but it's literally just one layer. You can't take anything out. This is what's on the inside. Right, fine. So I look at the cord and I'm like, hey, so how am I supposed to charge my phone? Like, how are me and my mom supposed to charge our phone tonight? Because I'm sure it's going to need a charge because it's been through a lot. And always, like, whenever you get a brand new phone, you want to charge it, whatever. So how am I supposed to charge my phone today? And I look at her, and I'm like, how does that work? And she goes, <laughs> So, you know, with the masks, you can't really tell anybody's expression. So I don't know if she noticed that I was type annoyed as she's speaking, but whatever. And she's like, <laughs> asking, she's like, so basically what Apple does now with the iPhone 12, you have to buy a new port. So I'm like, say what? And I'm like, okay, um, you have to buy a new port. It doesn't come with it for free, which already I'm annoyed. Cause I'm like, okay, we just spent like this amount of money and then now like we're gonna need a port because my phone's gonna die so what, what like what's next so i'm talking to her and she you know i'm just like okay like okay fine she's like give me one second goes away comes back and she's like you have to buy another port you can't tell in the light yeah you have to buy another port a different port to charge your phone for the iPhone 12. So I'm already like asking, you know, I'm asking all the questions and I'm like, okay, so, you know, the port that we used to have before, the box one, simple box one that we've used probably for all the iPhones, um, you know, can we just use those? And she's like, yeah, but you know, if you want this to last longer, you know, it's it would be better for you to just buy a new port. So I'm like, okay, thinking, and I'm like talking to my mom, and I'm like, okay, well, we're just gonna have to, like, I was like, well, we can just, and immediately I was like, because anybody who knows me and money, I'm already like, mm, well, we can use the uh, the same port. Like, what's wrong with that? I don't understand. And, but then my mom was like, you know, um, well, we can just, she's like, you know, it'll last longer. So I was like, you know what, you're right. Let me let my iPhones last a little bit longer this time because I feel like a lot of them for me um they last but it's just like you know I'm always having some issues so I was like whatever so I'm like okay fine I bought so we bought this port my thing is the fact that Apple does not have it automatically with you um Apple is literally taking over this world and it's so freaking annoying and they're just trying to get our money because you spend all this money on a phone and then you have to buy the port you have to buy the headphones you have to buy this you have to buy that and they make you think that you can like get like such great deals which not gonna lie like it's not even any of the representatives fault I just blame this all on Apple although I am an Apple user but as I'm going along and I'm like using my Apple products I'm learning that like I'm still trying to figure out the Apple world, like how this works. I mean, that's how they get their money. And it's understandable because Apple literally runs this world. But it's also so annoying that we had to buy an actual, an actual port for the iPhone 12. It was so, like, 
I don't know if anybody else has the Apple 12 and if it like pissed them off or maybe just I'm in the mood to rant. I don't know. But I had to buy an extra port and I was just so annoyed about it because I was like, this is what they did. Like they, I mean, for me, I was like, before this even happened, before we got the box, I was like, ooh, getting a new iPhone. Ooh, yeah, ooh, yeah. And then like my mood changed because of this freaking port. Cause I'm like, but I'm also spending another amount of money on this port because you just want extra money out of me and mind you you know like I feel like the little box ones like everybody has that like it's just it's just a thing like everybody has it it's not like it's not like one household doesn't have that box you know what I mean and even for like a probably like Samsung products like you can still use the box like and I just call it the box because it's literally like the infamous box, the infamous portal that you can literally use for any products. And the fact that now iPhone 12 has switched it up on us and was like, wait, bro, it was too good to be true. And have us paying an extra, like, I mean, I don't know how much like of all the stores were going for, but mine was going for $30. So, which mind you, it's not bad because obviously like, Obviously, like all the accessories that you get with your phone, they're going to be at least 25 and up. So it's not terrible. The price isn't my issue. It's just the fact that like I'm doing more on top of what I already spent for the actual phone. So it's like, OK, I got an upgrade for a good price, but I'm still paying more. And then I have to get this and I have to get that and I have to get that. It's just so annoying now. And I feel like it's like it's just maybe because I'm at that level with Apple where I'm just like, Oh my gosh, this is so annoying. Now, again, like I said, I am an Apple user and I probably will be for a little bit longer. Um, it's definitely nicer to have an Apple product and like your friends and like your family have Apple products um, because like the green, you know, and your messaging and just like you can send things, you know, because if you have like a Samsung, it's not as like compatible with the iPhones or the Apple world. Um, when you just have like that, those products, it's like not as compatible. So um, it's, it's like gonna give me like a moment if I do wanna switch to Samsung, which maybe, I don't know, I have to be more convinced to switch over to Samsung. Um, just because tonight Apple has really, really like disappointed me and annoyed me all in one night and I was just like I couldn't stop thinking about it and I was just like oh my god like the ride home I'm driving home and I'm like I I just can't stop thinking about this like I can't believe like we're just spending more on top of more on top of more on top of more and they're making you seem like you're getting a good deal but like I mean in reality yeah okay you might be still be getting a good deal but like are you getting that much of a good deal if you're like still spending more on accessories like I don't know. It just was like something that I had to rant about because that's just like what I wanted to talk about. I just had to, I had to, I had to rant. And it just like frustrated me. It really, really frustrated me. So, um, granted, the moral of the story is that like I am currently an Apple user. I don't know for how long though. That's the question. Like, cause they really genuinely pissed me off. And if they pissed me off any further, um, there has been some incidents for me personally with Apple and like, I've just been like so frustrated and like, there's just been some things where I'm like, oh, Apple, you're changing my life. <laughs> not in good ways. Like I'm not always smiling with you, Apple lately, but, um, yeah, I, it's just, it, it, it was just like my, my temporary Apple rant. Um, so I hope they change my mood with this iPhone 12. Um, like they said, I think like in whatever, like online commercials, whatever, the camera's supposed to be better on these phones. So um, I will obviously let you guys know once I take my official photo. Um, but, and like, you know, good details and all that stuff. So hopefully it is good and it's like something to rave about. If it is, I will have a follow up video about how the iPhone 12 may change my life. But right now, it's just me ranting about Apple um, and being annoyed for the night. It really just annoyed me. But anyways, I could just be, like I said, ranting just to rant or having some sense in this video. Not quite sure, 
but if you have apple products and want to talk about it with me tell me tell me tell me tell me or if you have the iphone 12 which now i do so anybody who has the iphone 12 um you know let's talk let's rant about it and like just talk about apple products in general and if you work with apple um i have no words for you right now um but shout out to target and verizon's customer service tonight because they did amazing um with me and my mom they were really really good i don't blame you guys because it's not you guys it's just this is about apple but um yeah i hope you like this video like subscribe um and go listen to my podcast as well black coffee 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 with a k um we are on all podcast streams and yeah i hope you liked my little rant and go watch my other videos because i have more to upload and tell you about life bye guys <laughs>